so the activity is there for both. Beautiful uppercut right there on the inside. That was a shot that. Nice right Ooh. hand from Vargas. Big shot. He hurt him with that. You yes. see his legs, the way it buckled looking for his kill shots. Nice counter left. Short shot from Emiliano Vargas. And the reason why I say that is, is because Alejandro, what he does is he's, when he jabs, he's floating. Mm. Floating to his mouth. He wants to get the work in and set up that shots like he does with that left uppercut. And then sets up the overhand right, digging to the body with the left. And you see the inch reach advantage for Emiliano Vargas with that 72 inch reach. But Ooh. it's the way he sets up that uppercut. Trying to figure out what it is he wants to do. And in those moments, what you have to do is you have to use your jab. These are key moments for him to use his game. He is still in there. Oh, Ooh. that shot right that there. Counter I don't know about that counter left from Vargas hurts Guardado. He's got him hurt and he's got him going down. And he just wants to land the shot that puts him down for good. He was almost touching with the knee and Guardado holding on for dear life. He's doing the right thing. He's trying to buy Nice himself. shot to the solar plexus from Emiliano, El General, Fernando Vargas. On Mexican Independence Day weekend against the Spaniard, trying to send a message to the lightweight division mm. as referee Lee Rogers steps in and stops the fight in favor of El General. How it started, the beginning of the end for Emiliano Vargas. Yeah, it starts with a right hand, then a nice little swivel jab, but you know, he has his man right there a pent against the ropes, and he's just digging down, just tee off. It's just target practice right here from Emilio Vargas. Uppercuts, body shots, you name it. He did everything in the book to try to end this match. He did, he did his job tonight, honestly. You know, I would say Alejandro came, he was game, he was tough, but he didn't have the skill set of a Vargas. Vargas' skill set is on another level. This is right here is a blue chip prospect. That's what you're seeing. You're seeing a future star. If he stays the course, if he stays focused, if he stays training in the ring and he doesn't let any of this stuff go to his head, trust me, people, I'm telling you right now, this young man is headed to the top. 